Hello, this is M with the Roman Mapping. Welcome back to Gabriel Might. Uh, we're here. We need to move around. Okay, so we we can't talk to that guy, so let's keep exploring. Um, in the intervening time, I looked up the first, like, set of things that I could do in this area. Or, like, in this game. Just to make sure I didn't miss anything super vital. And there is stuff I missed, like, in the... In the house, not the house, like my shop. So I'm gonna probably go do that. Um, the band isn't okay. There's no one. There. So uh, we're gonna explore this town, this this part of town first. Uh, see if we can meet anyone. There's two bands playing. Um, we're gonna record another three episodes today. Uh, thank you so much for going on this journey so far. Okay, another band. Was that a mine? Hello. It's one of those mimes. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, can we talk to the mime? I want to talk to the mime. Hello. Since Gabriel can read lips. <laughs> oh, I clicked through some dialogue. Was he following that lady? Are you gonna follow us? Hi. He just follows us. I wonder if we could get him to distract that police officer so he could uh, listen in or something. Because his his um, his radio is getting where that crime is, and we're supposed to investigate that crime. So I do know that's like a thing. This is if this is how this works is very similar to a uh, puzzle in the first. Uh, gosh, what's that game's name? Blackwell game. Hey, stop picking on me. I'll tell my dad! What? Did I lose the mime? Is that not... I followed... I'm really sad this is seemingly not the way. I wish he moved faster. Um, there's a there's a puzzle in the very first Blackwell game, Blackwell Legacy, I'm pretty sure, where you have to you have to um, get there's like a dog barking, and you have to route uh, like on a leash, and you have to route it around a light pole to like to um, get past because you're too anxious to do anything with the dog there. Anyway, this feels like it's probably the right thing. So let's see if we can do that. Oh, something's happening. Hey, cut that out. Oh, it's working. I told you to stop that. I told you to stop that. Mister, you want some of this? Gabriel likes his own. A cop has driven him on. Where's the radio? There's no reason. The radio won't. Oh, did I mess it up? Homicide team attempt. That was it, I just don't- I didn't know what verb to use. God. Okay. Well, I definitely know the answer is puzzle now, at least. Anyone seen Jill? And then we'll go back to, uh... We'll go back to the first place and... See about those objects we didn't get. I just looked at the first, like, two or three steps of this uh, day, and yeah, we, we did some things right, but we were not thorough enough. Hello. Come with me, Mime. Mr. Mime.
you white faced geek. Yeah, the mom just gets violence inflicted upon him. It's a shame because we gotta be very really careful about not running into people. Is what happened. In the scene transition, I guess. This is uh, fiddly in a way I'm not a, I'm not a fan of. Not a fan of it all. Come here, buddy. Okay, it's up there, so we need to like hand it or look at it. Are you little? Oh, I wish I didn't have to look at this animation every single time. Gabriel doesn't need the red on the moon. Oh, there we go. Gears. Gabriel picks up. Ambulance 91, have you located the. Damn! Did you say it was north of the lake? South. Lakeside Drive, north of Piedmont Pier, south of the Country Club. Oh, okay. Man, I don't know if it's the clouds out here today or... Everyone's having trouble. It's just so... Thank God. Enter. Hey, you... Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Okay, that's, that's good. We now have the next location. Um... Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. That should be on our map now, right? Yeah, okay. First things first, we need to go back to our shop. That is... This, right? I knew you'd miss me. I wish you wouldn't wear that. Okay, let me quickly pull up my uh device. I got the tweezers. I just want to like go through this so we can maybe not use this in the future. So, so let's get the tweezers and the magnifying glass. I did that on the upper left-hand bookshelf, like this one. The top shelf contains a set of German books that once belonged to Gabriel. Hey, kids. Bruno. How nice. Gee, a customer. Of yours. How's the fl Well, better than the used book business, I see. Rare books. This guy's an asshole. That explains why I so rarely see anyone in here. Are you going to sell me that wonderful painting of yours today? Um, how much would you give me for it, Bruno? Gabriel, don't you dare sell your father's painting. Well, I guess I don't need the money that badly. From the looks of this shop, I'm sure you will, my boy. And soon. As an asshole. Wait, right, so there's German the books. And said use hand icon on it? Gabriel selects a volume. Drei Drachen. Drei Drachen kriechen in meinen Schlaf. Die Ziele wollen sie lebendig zum Fraß. Hm. Feurigen Atems, geschwelltener Sunge, genießen sie jedes Mal. I don't know enough German That's for this. That's nice. Kind of creepy, though. Who's the author? Heinz Ritter. I'm not sure what it says. Isn't that someone who called? I get the feeling the guy was one sick puppy. Huh. All right, and then it said... Get snake book on upper right shelf up here? Gabriel pulls down a book 
on snakes. Snakes are legless reptiles. Some snakes kill their prey with poison, some by constriction. A snake smells by tasting the air with its forked tongue. The smells are passed back to a sense organ in the mouth. Constrictor snakes, however, sense their prey by vibration. Hmm. Did you know that many of the legends about dragons and giant worms are actually based on snakes? You know, dragons, devils, sea monsters, well, they've always been associated with snakes. Grace, get alive. Okay. Gabriel's had all the- Okay. And they said there's something under the window. Uh, just showing you what we need to go through. So we need Gabriel to- Gabriel leaves through a German-English dictionary. Let's see, mid tag means midday noon. Mid tag. Okay. And then there was cash register we could open. Gabriel opens the cash register to examine the tape. Or in the case of St. George Books, the miss tape. Ha ha ha. Um that's money. What's this? It's a gift certificate left over. Hmm. Can we hand that? I trust you can live without this old gift certificate. Cool. Knock yourself. Okay. That was everything. Uh, then there was stuff at Grandma's house. We did not fully explore the upstairs. I'll be back later. Have fun. Uh, grandmother's on the map. Animations. It's my favorite grandson. How nice. Your only grandson, but nice try, Grand. Okay. Make yourself at home. No, I, I would like to go upstairs. I was just here. Uh, eat. I'm going up the app. Enjoy. All right, so there's a book here. I think I'll take Daddy's sketchbook with me. Okay. My inventory? Yes. Oh, hello. Images haunt the pages. The images touch. Image the. Okay. And then. There's something about looking at the clock or clock. An clock. elaborate mechanical clock. Probably of German. It doesn't seem. So we can operate it apparently. Oh, right, the gears are operate, so we need to remember that. Hmm. Gabriel can't operate. Can I hand the. The key should stay with the clock. I'll probably operate. Yeah. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. The hands do nothing. Really? No. Can I oh push? Okay. So it doesn't do anything. Do we have a clue about the 
those. Oh, book, yeah. That kind of looks like a... Images. The images touch a deep cut. Images. The... Snakes. Lion. It almost looks like a clock. It also might be something clocky. The label on the head. Your copy is... Yeah, none of that. I don't know. It's an operate the clock. I, uh, when I did this, I did the, I put the thing a couple days ago and I didn't put the solution because I wanted to figure it out. It did, it did, there is a puzzle with that clock, but I don't think we have enough information to figure it out yet. So, um, we'll just leave it for now. And if we get stuck, we get stuck. Is there more we can talk to Gran about? That's it. Can we? Of course. Do you know anything about any, anything else? We've asked about all these. No, we haven't. Do you have any idea? Hmm. Something without something, I think. My French is so rusty. I swear my mind is going. It's okay, thank What can you tell me about St. John's Eve? St. John's Eve? The mass was said at one time on the way home. We were wet. My father was fu- Okay, that's enough for now. Let's go to the crime scene. That's clearly the thing we we're meant to do next. The door. Well, Gran. All right, dear. Slowest animation in the world. Do do do. Okay. On to the crime scene. The crime scene team is still at the site. Gabriel parks a bit out of the way and walks over to avoid adding to the general confusion. Okay, what we got? We got marks. Got the body and blood. I think there might be something over here. It's just police tape. Hey, mostly. Huh? <sighs> Night, you wiener. I told you not to call me that. Feeling jumpy? Who, me? Don't be stupid. How'd you find me? Oh, I was just driving by. Mm-hmm. Well, for the book. But don't tell anyone I let you see this, huh? Cool. We're gonna explore. It's another one. As you can see, same M.O. and no frickin' clues. We're still waiting on an ID for the body. That's disgusting. Isn't this a rather, uh, public area for this kind of thing? Yeah, they're freaking ghosts, these guys. Lakeshore Drive isn't exactly the 10 Expressway, but it is open to the public. No reports and nothing. Now, who the hell is that? Hmm. Who is it? Oh, there we go. It's a beautiful lady. Do I know her? <clears throat> Good day, Miss Getty. What's going on, officer? 
Detective Mosley, ma'am, we've got a little problem here, but nothing for you to be concerned about, Miss Getty. I don't think we know her. I see. Thank you, Detective. And good day, gentlemen. We saw their tomb at the funeral, or at the cemetery. Whoa, I'm in love. Forget it. That's Molly again. She's about as far out of your reach as the moon. Probably on her way to meet some guy with a yacht right now. Near here? The lake's a popular place for country clubs. If she's out here a lot, maybe she saw something or heard something. Man, nobody ever sees or hears nothing. I told you. Besides, you just don't go around bothering people like her. We've about wrapped it up, sir. It's another clean sweep. Yeah, let's get the meat wagon moving, then. Do you want to leave an officer here, sir? Nah. Just leave the tape up for a few days. Yes, sir. If you'll excuse us, sir, we'll take him away. All right. I want to do some investigating. Stick around and take notes for the book if you want. Watch out for the muck in the water moccasins, though. I'll be back at the station. Stop by if you want to go over the case some more. Thanks. Okay. We're going to end here. Uh, I'll be right back after this, and uh, we will resume again. Thanks, everyone. Bye.